Okay, another weekend of work is done. And I'm showing you where we are at, what's been done. Driveway is tightened up really good from all the rain. It's really hard and uh, pretty smooth. The uh, vegetation started to grow back up a little bit. The weeds grew up a little from all the rain. We still got about four piles of millings there for future driveways and parking pads. We got one little pile of fill dirt left that we're going to spread out down by the main house. Another pile of millings. Driveway. You can see the lake now. Coming up to the shop, which is been graded out and the grade beam dug all the way around, the foundation dug all the way around. And that's ready to be formed up, put steel on it, and pour the concrete. Got some dirt piled up for backfill up against the slab when we get it done so that it's nice and level. More millings, trucks running and cooling off, and the excavators loaded, ready to go. Dug up the electric line that was longer than what we needed, so I dug it up to where it goes in between the garage, shop, and Kyle's cottage. This is Kyle's cottage with the foundations dug. All that we like to do there is uh, put in a uh, sewer stub out for the septic and stub the water over. It goes down and behind those trees. Comes out right here. That's the end of it. And then we have the stakes for Lee's studio which goes right here on this piece of ground. Kyle's trailer is parked in the side of the uh, main house and it's all laid out. Got the main house here. And then we've got the garage over there. Got a nice big stock pile of really pretty logs to have milled into wood to do woodworking. This is the center of the main house. This will be what we're seeing when we're looking out the back windows of the house, except for not the piles of wood. And then this is where we'll be on the back porch of the house. Slowly but surely we're getting there. That's it. Show you again next week.